Hi everyone, I got delivery today, and when I opened the envelope, I thought there was nothing inside except a bubble wrap, but then I found this tiny little PCB inside, and I remembered what it is that I ordered. It's a charger designed for batteries like this 18650, but it can charge at 2 amps, and it's got a micro USB port on it. Now, I know a lot of people are going to say, oh, you shouldn't really charge it 2 amp because it's going to get the battery hotter and it won't last as long, and yes, that's true that typically you want to charge them at a slower rate, for instance, 1 amp, so they don't get so hot and they have a longer life, but there will be times when you just want to charge a battery as fast as possible, and that's why I bought this little module here. And I actually got this 18650 battery holder separately, and I've just soldered it onto the board here. So now I've got my USB power bank going through a watt meter into the little charger using a micro USB cable and we're charging this Samsung ICR 186526F and that's a genuine Samsung. So let's have a look at my watt meter and we can see it's currently at 4.7 volts, 1.5 amp. So a little bit lower than I expected. Let me try change it to the other USB port. Okay, so now it's a little bit higher, 4.8 volts, 1.6 amp, 1.7 amp. Uh, okay, it's fluctuating a little bit, but it's not quite too amp. So I wasn't happy with those results, so I'm now testing using a regular AC USB wall adapter, and we are actually getting 2 amp now, or 1.94, so close enough to say that's 2 amp. So yeah, it's a very, very tiny module. What do you think about this? This is my little Christmas tree that I soldered together. It's pretty cool. Anyway, we are getting 2 amp out of this. Now, like I said, you won't always want to charge your batteries at that speed, because it will reduce their life, but if you need to charge an 18650 nice and quickly, you might might like this board. Now what I want to do is leave this charging for around 15 minutes and see if we get any heat in the battery and the little PCB itself. So we'll come back in 15 minutes. So the 15 minutes are up, let's take a look at how the charging's going. You can see that we've put in 2 watt hours, which is pretty good in that short period of time, but it's currently charging at 1.4 amp. Of course, as the voltage of the battery increases, the charge rate will decrease. As for the board here, it's pretty hot. I mean, I don't think it's got any hotter than when it started, and I can touch it, but yeah, it is pretty hot. But I wouldn't say dangerously hot, I think it's acceptable. So yeah, that's it really. Um, I will put a link to this board in the video description down below. It was only like a couple of dollars, very cheap. So if you want something that can very quickly charge an 18650 or a similar battery, then this might be the board for you. So if you enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.